Hi, Gabriel and, and, and hi, Ed. And I want to say thank you very much for Gabriel for standing in for uh, Bruno Cabata, who is the, is the boss man in, in that. But you're standing in because you've got a background with Becca. What is your background with Becca? Well, thank you very much, Brian. Yes, my background goes back to the early gleam in the eye discussions before Becca was even named as Becca. And so my background has been to help uh, generate some of the thinking behind what has now become the Becca joint venture. So this is, and so this is to establish uh, a, a capacity, uh, a platform, and I think, gosh, we don't half overuse that word platform, uh, f I I I within this region to, uh, to establish biosciences capacity. Is that correct? And in simpler terms, indeed, it's to establish first-class laboratory facilities and the technical capability to enable scientists to conduct research on the problems in the region and for the region. Why here at Ilri? Because even now, Ilri has the best laboratory facilities for biosciences <coughs> within Eastern and Central Africa. And so, as a result of the many years of investment, both in the physical facilities, but also the human and technical capacity, uh, NEPAD, when it was looking to establish the Centre of Excellence, identified Ilri as the appropriate host for the hub facility. Okay, what's been your role, Ed? Uh, Ed and I noticed you took that lovely photograph of you as a young man. Uh, uh, <laughs> you, hid it in your, you, you hid it in your top pocket. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, thanks, Brian. Uh, my, role, um, my role actually goes back to three years ago when I was appointed the director of the biotech team. At that time, there was no... Um, S there was nobody substantively uh, taking care of the, the Becker uh, process. I was asked by the Director General to help move that forward. So I was doubling up as well as the, uh, you could say, the interim coordinator. One of the things that Becker. puzzles me, though, uh, um, that uh, with your, your roles and the roles of others, is that we've been for, for long trying to uh, help contribute to the capacity of national research systems. Uh, we have down the road what was the East African Research Organ uh, Organization at uh, Maguga. Uh, why wasn't it put there? Now that's... Okay, Brian, <laughs> you've gone all quiet. Brian, first of all, first of all um, I think it is not fair to ask uh, Gabriella about the, East Af what the old East African community, but let me just try to answer that. Um, the old East African community is no more. The facilities are not in any shape close to what Ilri uh, has. And as uh, Gabriella said earlier, the principle behind Becker was not to create new institutions, not to build brick and mortar, but to create, create processes that will allow using the existing platforms or ex existing facilities allow things to start happening. I understand that, but the whole point is that how does that, how, how do we make sure that this is not a, a, a competition? I mean, uh, and, and, and what is the role of, what, what is the feeling of Cary and Leary and, and the lab down in Tomeki and other places? How do they, how do they view this? Yes, sir. I'm not at, at all behind the door in answering questions about the East African com community and existing facilities and indeed previous regional efforts which have failed and we don't underestimate the challenge of developing a biosciences network within the region and indeed the evolution of the thinking has gone a long way from saying this is a biosciences facility located at Uri to now this is a Becker network within the region of which Uri will host the hub. There will also be a series of other nodes and other participants. So indeed Kari, Isipe, other institutions in the region have been very much involved in the design process, part of the steering committee and now part of the implementation. Okay, great. Now we've got this, we've got this platform uh, and the idea is that there we bring up, we have all these facilities and come on guys, open the doors, they all come in uh, and off you go with your, with your research. My question is, does one size fit all? You have a platform uh, that meets all the different uh, types of research that could be done? Maybe it, both of you can ask that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> In, indeed, no. One, si one size certainly doesn't doesn't fit all, and that is why the the evolution of the concept has been to develop a network to make sure that there are different capacities both in different countries, different institutions and it requires the whole critical mass to be mobilised uh, in order to actually achieve some good outcomes. Yeah, and at the, at the hub, which is what is hosted at Ilri, the idea is to focus on one, things that are normally very expensive and people, I mean individual institutions would not on their own be able to, 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 to have their own. Secondly, to have generic 
generic capacities to do research that c cuts across crops, uh, cuts across different crops, uh, to livestock, to pathogens, and so on. Well, that so brings me to the point, in the document, it talks about uh, agriculture, uh, re re bioscience research for agriculture. Well, isn't, why not livestock agriculture? I mean, ILRI is already at risk of losing its identity with the, uh, the East Africa and the West Africa CG centers. I mean, why don't we hang on to our, uh, our, our livestock side here? I think that is precisely the problem that w most people have in perceiving what this is about. This is not about ILRI. This is something being created with ILRI being a player, and livestock is just a component of this thing. So, as I have said earlier, it is generic to the, uh, so that, in fact, ILRI can benefit from it, but it is not a livestock platform. But my question is, uh, shouldn't it be, uh, given Ilry's uh, role, Ilry's brokering role in this process? I mean, should we not be looking after ourselves a little bit, Ed? <laughs> no, we should. <laughs> <laughs> Brian, we should, we should, and we are looking after ourselves. But we have made it very clear that Becker is not Ilry, and Ilry is not Becker. But Ilry is a partner in the Becker platform, and Ilry will have access to that facility. By expanding, um, by actually allowing other things to happen at ILRI, in fact we are placing ourselves even in a better position to be known as an institution that is very, very much outward looking, forward looking, and is understanding the concept of generic technologies. Okay. Um, I notice re reading in, in, in the various parts of the documentation, it says the function is to catalyze joint venture research, and also the Becker, uh, Becker Secretariat will champion bioscience research in the region. Isn't this a little bit too broad and too idealistic? Uh, I, mean, I mean, what if you compare that with, let's say, food, disease, genetics, so food feed crops, vaccine against X and Y, or, or resistance? I mean, isn't that a little bit more tangible for the people in the region? Well, in, indeed, I've read these documents once or twice myself. <laughs> <laughs> and indeed, I, I believe it, it, it describes the purposes to look at the applications of biosciences to agriculture and their intersections with human health and the environment and indeed not only to catalyse but also to develop products near term to get them to markets so the platform indeed can host pro uh, projects. The intention is that these projects will actually deliver feasible outcomes. Okay. Now, I quote again, it says uh, in, in there needs to be a close functional relationship between the Becker scientific team and Ilry's theme 4, Ed, that's you, uh, to maximise research synergies and plan scientific work as effectively as possible. Uh, sounds wonderful. What does it mean? <laughs> First, first of all, I think, I think there, is, there is a correction that needs to be made. It is true that the Becker platform has a, a greater link with, uh, with the biotech theme because of the very nature of, of the platform. However, uh, it is envisioned that, in fact, there will be linkages, for example, with an innovation systems type, type work um, to, un to understand how else one might actually approach uh, biosciences um, in, the, in the region, what kind of innovative ap approaches, institutional arrangements one could do. So that's just to explain that it is not just bio, uh, biotechnology. However, given the fact that um, the most of the technology platforms that will be, uh, will be here will actually be biotechnology, it, it therefore requires that we, and because we will be a big user as a biotechnology team, it requires that we have a very strong and organic relationship with with um, with with the, with with the, with, the, with Becker. Now, what does that mean? It means that as hosts, which is the, that's what Ilri is. Took is a long time to get around the Yes, <laughs> as hosts, um, as hosts, we we are we are given the responsibility of facilitating the secretariat. Now, facilitating in includes, for example, providing access to sequencing, providing access to different uh, capacities. Because those are shared and because they're within the labs, it is important that the sharing processes, access issues, <coughs> are actually governed by ag agreed principles. Okay, what is the role for other players, the private sector, the, the uh, agribusiness, the agri pharmaceutical industry? I, I, there's a very successful uh, example that I visited in Western Australia, which has got all these different players, public, private, etc. Is that what we're trying to mimic here? I wouldn't say mi mimic, but, in, but in indeed to look at the experience of some of these uh, technology platforms around the world, which indeed, because of the way science is changing, are becoming more the norm, and indeed to be very open to a range of different players. Will there be, be other players that you anticipate will be interested? Uh, absolutely. Who are so, they going to be? So the range of players will include from the African side and scientists from national universities, 
national institutes and universities, but indeed private sector partners, advanced research institutes, so that indeed the whole spectrum of players that's required to conduct first class research to get an, a deliverable product can be involved at all stages of the process. Okay, under this same agreement, which is under uh, NEPAD, uh, there, are, there are plans for three other uh, labs uh, within Africa. And one, I noticed that there's an advertisement out for the, uh, the director of San Bio, which is going to be in Pretoria. You probably applied it. What is going to be the link between Becker and San Bio? Would you like to answer? First of all, I would like to, to know the, the website so I can apply. <laughs> but, <laughs> but I mean, seriously, um, the, idea, the idea of the biosciences, Eastern and Central Africa, was to, I mean, um, was premised on the understanding that it will not be limited just to Eastern and Central Africa, but that, that, that the network, it will be a network involving different components. So this is one component. There would be one for Southern Africa. There would be one for Western Africa. Yeah, in Senegal. And in uh, uh, to be based in Senegal. So the one, one in Egypt. And there's, there, there will be one for North, Northern Africa. Now, this is the most advanced, and in fact, lessons are being learned as to uh, what, what kind of things should be done differently as they develop these others. The Southern Africa, the idea again is that not all these different network, uh, pa pa partners in the network will all be uh, looking at one disciplinary um, area. For example, this is more agriculture and more biosciences. There will be one on biosciences, but maybe more to the, to the medicine. There will be ma more that is stronger maybe on, on well, something else. Some overriding um, organ communicating or, or providing steering advice to them? Yes, the overriding... Uh, Body. What's the word? Body, yes, perhaps, uh, is, is NEP NEPAD uh, forming a rather loose network at the moment. And um, one of the challenges in, in working with NEPAD has indeed been should all these different nodes of the network proceed at the same pace? But indeed, there'd been much quicker progress in Eastern <coughs> and Central Africa, and a memorable exchange was between some of the other regions saying, couldn't you go a bit slower? And Anesmo saying, why don't you catch up with the rest of us? <laughs> okay, my last question is actually for Ed. Now, there has been theme four. Uh, there's been a lot of criticism, I think, over uh, as time goes on, of theme four being the only theme in the Institute that is supply-driven. And that was part of the design. So we've, got, we've changed to a demand-driven themes. Uh, but theme four is we've got this uh, biosciences and so we're going to come in and uh, now with Becker, which is pure supply, isn't it time that theme four reorientated itself to become demand driven totally by the other themes and the other uh, partners we have in the region? First of all, uh, let, me, let me reiterate what I said earlier. The no, no, I don't want you to reiterate, let me reiterate what, you what I said. <laughs> I want Becker, you to answer my question. The fact <laughs> now there is Becker seems to sound like we are saying Becker has been added to theme four. And I said earlier, Becker is not theme four. I heard that. Now, but I'm can I go? About the facilities that I, we've got. I hear you, I hear you. Now, the Becker facilities will provide will provide a platform that we in theme four can use. So we will be the, the demand on that supply that you just described. So there will be. There will, we <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we will be part of the users of the, of the, of the supply we have, that, that is being created through this process, thereby allowing us, allowing us to focus on those things which are not generic and which are only unique to livestock. So that's the, that's part of the, the, the strategy. And will you become more uh, more of a s uh, servant, if you like, that's a, uh, to the uh, work of the other themes, possibly, um, Ed, as a last final yes or no? <laughs> 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 yes or no. <laughs> Thank you both very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.